Hey guys, in this video I will show you how to easily find out uh, someone's public uh, IP address using a simple link. I will mention the disclaimer. All my videos are for education purposes and ethical hacking. The videos are not intended as guides to illegal activities. Now we can start. Go to your browser and uh, type in uh, iplogger.org. On that page uh, you need to paste uh, in uh, some wallet URL, uh, for example, with a link to some uh, YouTube video, uh, for example, a car video. For our example, let's take the very first uh, video that uh, came up. We copy the link and uh, paste it uh, into IP logger. We click on create link. Of course, uh, we have to agree uh, to the policy. Here we can check uh, the box, uh, for example, uh, collect smart data. We can, of course, also take a uh, collect GPS data, for example, but uh, beware, this option then pops up uh, on the user uh, when they click through the link. The moment uh, we have the link uh, ready, uh, we copy it and uh, when we enter it uh, into the browser, you can see that uh, we are automatically redirected uh, to the YouTube video. Then in uh, IP logger now at the bottom of the visitors section, we can see ourselves. We need to refresh the page or click uh, elsewhere. As you can see, there is an uh, immediate uh, record that uh, I actually uh, clicked through to the link to the video. Here you will see the public IP address, uh, geolocation, device type, etc. You can also click uh, right on smart data to get more details. However, a link uh, like this uh, isn't exactly pretty and uh, people wouldn't click on it uh, much. Uh, that's why it's a good idea to use some shortener, uh, for example, in Bitly. Therefore, in order to use uh, Bitly, it's uh, good uh, to register. I log in and uh, on the top left uh, we click on create new. We select the link, insert our link uh, to the IP logger and uh, click on uh, create your link. Once Bitly creates the link, uh, we can send the link to anyone and uh, get their location and uh, public IP address. When I test it in the browser, I am indeed redirected from the bitly to the IP logger and then to YouTube, uh, which then allows me to see another entry in the IP logger. Let's talk uh, some more about uh, how to detect that uh, someone is sending me something like this. If all you see is a link to Bitly, uh, you can find out uh, where it goes uh, by using the curl tool. When you use the curl on the command line and uh, put a link uh, in uh, a Bitly here, uh, curl doesn't automatically do that. It redirects just those links. Uh, so if you do a curl on a link uh, from a Bitly, you can immediately see where the link is going. So if someone sends you a shortnet link uh, and uh, you don't completely trust the person, uh, it's a good idea to test this first. Thanks for watching and uh, if you like this video, please like and subscribe and uh, share this channel. Thank you very much.